Oh! There's like a dungeon below, below it. Oh, I don't know if it's a dungeon. But there's a big staircase going down below our heavy and I wonder if we can get on it. Oh, Holy moly! Oh, I feel concrete in so we can't get down there. Oh! You can see it through the window. Look at the staircase down there. Whoa. Oh, it just goes into nowhere. <laughs> city, like a whole city of tunnels and you don't even know that it's there. <laughs> Goodbye. Verona. Verona. Oh my God, you're the worst. <laughs> we change places all the time. I never know where we are. To Milan. <laughs> and then lead the way. Yo, good morning! We're in Milan! I'm just playing, it's not morning, it's like 2 o'clock in the afternoon. We've been working all morning. It's been making vlogs and shit. Where are we going? I have no idea, there's apparently some cemetery that Hannah found. And apparently it's amazing, so we're gonna go to a cemetery. Okay, got it. The elevator only holds two people at a time. Anyway, it's a great day here in Milan. Apparently it's like a really flash place. Um, Mum came here, she, keep, she keeps raving about it, so. So, we're probably not gonna do much, to be honest, because we're, uh, we're getting ready for Ireland. I wanna do like, sometimes you gotta like chill. At the moment, here in Verona, it's like chill time. At times I like to do that. <laughs> Level four. I'm getting kinda hungry, so I think the first thing we'll do is try to find something to eat. Hey! Good to meeting you guys down here. Oh, small world. I walk the stairs, so I don't take elevators. What? Just, oh, whatever. I'm just playing. Oh, look at the tram. Let's take the tram. Milan, you are looking good already. I'm liking it. We've been overheating lately. It feels good to like, woo. Tram. Oh, look how cool it is. Tram of Paso Dumo. Italia. Italia? Italia. See? Who's keen for a coffee? Me. Yes. Oh, let's hope we can figure out how to pay for this one. Last time we really screwed up and we didn't pay for the bus. <laughs> no one was paying for it though. So. We didn't know how either. So confusing. We're on the train and we haven't paid. What do we do? What Enjoy we, the ride. What if we get arrested? Oh, <laughs> what? Either that or the the fact that <laughs> I really don't know how to pay. And I more want understandable. to. understandable. I want to pay. <laughs> I really don't know how to buy tickets for the trains and stuff. It's tough being a good good person. <laughs> <laughs> Made it. Look at it. Look at it. That's crazy. And there's like no one around. There we go, now you can probably see it. You're pretty much like, you're going for an Instagram shot around all these tombs. Well, oh yeah, man, I don't know where those are actually tombs. Okay, maybe not. Okay, cut. So, 79, 1980, 1983. This is like prime 2005, this is like really recent. Ah, oh, this is hectic. 2010 is the most recent person, that was only seven years ago. It says on the internet that it's not like a sad cemetery, like you don't come in here and feel sad, like it's a celebration more so. Of I life. think all these people um, are quite celebrated in their own right for something. Yo, this place is crazy. This is like, this is very impressive. Just cremate but me and just throw my ashes you, somewhere, I'll be right. Want, like, you want to, you want to be cute? Oh, right, pull me into the ocean, I'll be right, it. and then just let me dissolve into the into the water. That'd be the best thing for me, guys. If ever I go, oh look at this. Slow mo. Zoom in to transition. Where are we? The entrance is there, so we've just gone like that. We've there. been walking for like 10 minutes looking all around going, wow, this place is amazing. We've seen just like that much of that. This like place is really like no joke. It would be like, imagine coming here at night time. Say it again for the camera so you can put it in the vlog. Imagine coming here at night. Whoa, yeah, and that would be crazy. <laughs> I find this really funny, like, Hannah's really into this. And Matt hasn't had his morning coffee yet. So Matt's, like, really struggling. He just wants to go get coffee. So you watch. I'm going to try to get Hannah, like, being excited. And then Matt just, like, not even interested. Was she transition? Was she transition now? And again. Oh, oh and another one. Oh, <laughs> again. Boom. Do you want to do a wishy transition, hand? What is that? Like this. <laughs> yeah, is you that do it? it. Yeah. Well, this is by far the biggest uh, cemetery I've ever seen. Oh, snap. Don't film it. 
Why, yeah. just in case Isn't we thought, what if we capture oh, a ghost on camera? I don't know. I don't know. They've left it open. There's an open weird. tomb right there. What do you think of that, Anne? It's pretty amazing. A little hidden gem that's not at all hidden and it's totally massive and it's like one of the most highly rated things to do here in Milan. All right, kids. Life struggles. We're really hungry and there's like nowhere around or we don't, we don't know where to go anywhere for, to find food. It's kind of like siesta time. We don't know if anywhere's open. Can't find anywhere on the old internet. Internet. I say let's point each point in a direction. Then we'll play paper, scissors, rock, whoever wins, we go their direction. Good idea? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I choose that way. Fuck those words. I was going to choose that way too. Oh, let's just go that let's way! Go. <laughs> I love it when we all work together, team. Back on the train hand, still don't have tickets this time. I just don't know how to do the ticket thing. Oh, that's a little bit of cheese there. So many cheese fridges in Italy. Just scattered around the whole supermarket. <laughs> You know in New Zealand like you have to walk through the fruit and vegetable aisle first when you first enter the thing. It's like here it's like cheese aisle. It's like two euro. And then you pair the cheese with prosciutto and ham. And then just more prosciutto. It's my favourite. Can we get that one? There's holes in it. Well, this, that means there's less cheese. The way to make shopping fun. Hello. You put everything on the conveyor belt thing, but you're not allowed to make anything touch anything else. You normally play the game hand. Don't change the camera. You love the game. I never play the game. I, I know she likes the true. game. So you've got to put it really close together. And people at home, they'll play the game and they'll appreciate it too. Hey, don't put the eggs. Those are touching here. Oh, did you find a protein bar? Do you have to make them not touch in the plastic bag as well? No, no, game's over. Everyone ruined my game. No, there's stuff every, touching in the... Everyday life. So domesticated. Come on. Are we going to do a cooking with mate segment tonight? Alright ladies and gentlemen, so tonight on Cooking with Nate, we're going to have a real simple meal. Uh, just a couple of ingredients. So first what you're going to do is walk out into the garden, just dip your hand into the garden, let it go onto the plate. You have round one, and then... Now this... Don't. Do down there. No, 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 away from what that is. This is a secret, my secret recipe chicken. So, this can take some time to prepare, and you cook it in the stove or in the oven or wood fired oven if you have sometimes. It can take a while to pluck the feathers, pull out the gut, cut the chicken's head off. Not that nice of work. But once you've done, put it in the oven for about an hour and a half, and then you should end up with something a little like this. Um, and then you pick up the chicken. That was cooking with Nate. Ciao for now. Wait, wait, seriously? Yeah. Bon appetit. Where's the sauce? And you don't need sauce. You have chicken. You can do anything. It's one oh, right. Right.